February the 1st, 2024. A whole month has gone by this year already. Snickers and I are leaving Gila Bend, the Sonora Desert RV Resort, which is very nice. And we are headed to Ironwood National Monument for the Ironwood 24 Meetup. So follow along. Here we go. Well, I'm off on another adventure. Calling this Desert 2024. Just me and Snickers. Okay, Snickers, here we go. We go bye bye. Ragged Top Mountain. I bet you can guess where I am. I'm at Ironwood National Monument at the Ironwood 24 Meetup. A few campers out there. That's the road I came in on. There's my car. There's my Mini Winnie. And there's Merton and Sue's. Finicky Frida. And there's Merton. Wave, Merton. <laughs> They saved me a spot. And you might see that there are campers way out in the distance. I think that's all of the group. There might be more coming tomorrow. I'm a day early. But uh, it's going to be a fun time here at Ironwood. Here's what it looks like behind my camper. This is my backyard. Yeah, there's even a saguaro right there. And a bunch more over there. And that's west. So the sunset is going to be over in that direction. I'll wait for it. Snickers and I made it to Ironwood National Monument. And we found everyone at the Ironwood Meetup. Sue and Merton Carnell were nice enough to save me a spot right near their RV, so I am right near their RV. I got to meet their new little puppies, Gracie and Spike, and so Snickers got to meet them also. They are cutie pies for sure. Okay, well, I'm going to be here for about six more days, and there will be lots of activities that I'm going to record. Good morning from Ironwood National Monument. This is the view out my dinette window this morning at about 8 o'clock. We had a big rainstorm last night. Lots of wind, lots of rain. But things seem to be clearing up. But I don't think it's over. I think more is coming. The sun on those mountains is gorgeous this morning. And there's Ragged Top with the sun on it. Here we go for the rest of the day. Look at this Choa cactus with uh, little flowers on it. It's been raining for the last couple days so they have bloomed up. And today is February the 2nd. And there's Ragged Top Mountain in the background. And the first part of the storm is gone. But I think there will be more rain to come. There's one of our group. Simple life, big adventures. I guess they've been waiting a little too long. Funny. Very cool. Snickers and I are going down to campfire tonight. 
at the Ironwood Meetup. So I'm going to drive you through all the camp, all the campers. I don't know, there's something like 50 or 60 people here. for the big fire tonight. There's Mary. Mary, wave. Oh, hi. Okay, what's your name? Um, um, think of something. Think of something. He's wanted. Oh, James. James. He's wanted. That's what his name is. He's Fred. wanted. Fred. I met Fred the other day. Jeannie, and I see Steve and Oki behind them. And I'm Sue. Sue. They're talking. There's Amanda. Uh, <laughs> Laura. Laura. JJ. JJ. Teddy Bear and the Candy Man, the candy man Mr. Wolf, Mark Wolf. <laughs> hey, Brock! <laughs> I'm good. How about yourself? That's good. It's... Oh, we're getting ready to have some music. Shake it up, D. Shake it up. A pretty barrel cactus with some little yellow blooms on it. Not blooms, but pods on it. More like gathering around the food. We're gathering around the potluck here. People are starting to arrive. And there's Ron. I haven't said hello to Ron this trip around. I'm doing just great. Good. I think I've got a new sticker since I've seen you. Oh, fabulous. Yeah. Oh, he's got so much on his mind, you know. Yeah, I've I'm, I'm, I'm been busy like a chicken with his head cold. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we want to make the experience, you know, great for everybody. Well, it was great last year, and so far it's great so far, yeah. yeah Enjoying it. good folks returning from last year. We got new people. We have new nomads, and we have nomads that have never been to a meetup before. Yeah. That have been nomads for a year and a half, so they're, mm. that, that's, uh, yeah. actually, that's, Darren walking this way and his wife been in the have been no bass for a year and a half. This is her first meetup. First meetup. We have Winifred. Uh, yeah, I met friend, Fred. She, yeah, uh, she's uh, at her first meetup. Yeah, well, we're absolutely <laughs> happy to bring everybody together and uh, we hope everybody enjoys it. We had live entertainment last night. We'll bring it was great. We'll have live entertainment two nights next year. We're hoping you can do it, Marshall. Nope. Uh oh. Whoa, Snickers. Snacks. <laughs> You gotta cut that up if you're gonna feed it to Snickers. Nope. Okay, Marshall's here gonna be cooking some dogs, not Snickers, hot dogs. And there's Sue, and they brought the puppies out. Little Spike and Gracie. They're so cute.
host really appreciate you all coming out uh, to our meetup, our third annual event. So this is just something we wanted to do to help build community and bring like-minded people together. And uh, we're really happy with the turnout this year. I mean, we awesome. blew away yes. last year. So thank you all yeah. very much for being, being here. And, uh, you know, we have a lot of great ideas and plans for the next meetup. So we hope that you will help spread the word and come back next year when we do this again. Okay. You know, this is great meeting. It's not cheap. They bought the wood and the tent and all these things. If anybody wants to come to it's a free event. If anybody wants, I'm the good at that, or sorry. Uh, do we have a dojo in jar besides the tin? A dollar, five dollars, tin, what is it for? Do you want to? Lots of food, lots of food. Hot dogs, hamburgers, fixums, and lots of sides. And we got desserts over here. Desserts over here. Lots of people here for the potluck. Gentleman over there in the red shirt is Mo Bang for your bucks. We got Chantel, we got Lucy and Brian from Wo Nelly Adventures. There's Mark Wolf over there with the black shirt with the green writing. Marshall, Ron sees America. Oh, Greg is over there too. And we got another group of people over here, Martin and Sue with the puppies, Star, Fred, and some other folks over here that are new, and around the corner up here, all enjoying the potluck. And you just wrap around, and then you use your little needle to connect. And I'll show you how to do it. But So you can choose if you want it to be a little bit bigger. Maybe you want to use a plastic bag. If you want to make the mini one, then we'll use the jute and um, embroidery thread. Or you can use the jute and yarn. Um, I also brought a t-shirt string. This is an old t-shirt that I cut. To make yeah, a string, you yeah. can move around this. So that, there's <laughs> a bunch in there. So. Yeah. Uh, yeah. so what we need to get started, everybody has their needles. Mm -hmm. You just need to choose what size of cording you want to be going around. If you want Amber also taught an acrylic painting class. This is Lucy's painting. This is stars. We painted a desert scene and tried to paint our rigs in the picture. Most of us did a sunset, but others did their own thing, and they all came out beautiful. This is Sue's painting, and this is my painting, and you can look and see Snickers in my motorhome. I'm about ready to go into the community tent and show people how to paint a postcard. Stay tuned. Starting my watercolor painting class, watercolor postcard. Okay, who has done watercolor before? Where it had to look like something? No, you could just do an abstract. Okay, okay, okay. All right, that's okay. Yes, sir. Well, if you if you sold it, it counts. <laughs> All right, let's get started. We're at the drying point of the paintings. Everybody's got the start of the sunset going on. Everybody having fun? Yes. Good. That's the main thing. Have fun. Don't you want to have fun? Fool around someone. Don't you want to have fun? This is Amber. She's the first one to finish her painting. Yay! Everyone was successful with their postcard artwork. This is Lucy. Here's Allison. And Oki did a beautiful sunset. And there's Sue. 
And there's Star with her sunset and picture of Ragged Top Mountain. And there's Sue also with her beautiful sunset. Last but not least, there's Steve. This is proof that you can teach an old dog new tricks. He's never done painting other than his painting his house before. <laughs> I didn't do an ending at the time, so I'm doing one now. Thanks for watching all the way through. I know this was a little longer than most, but I think it was worth it. I hope you enjoyed the video about my experiences at the Ironwood 24 meetup, our activities, my painting class, and all the other activities. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Comment, share, and subscribe. Stay crafty, smart, creative, and safe. When at the Ironwood 24 meetup. And I plan on going in 25. Thanks for watching. Don't Bye you now. Wanna have fun, fool around someone.